Victor Frankenstein started stitching the replicated human body parts together and then used electricity to bring his creation to life. However, his creation waved about and sabotaged the machinery. Victor fled the room and the monster disappeared. To be continued. What do you mean to be continued? I was rather enjoying that. Because, Badger, first it's getting late. Ten o'clock at night it is. All because you left a mess in the kitchen, as always. Second, it took me two hours to clean it up again. And I was hoping to go to bed straight away. But you were eagerly wanting me to carry on reading that Mary Shelley novel. And that's what's the trouble. Oh, come on. Carry on. Badger, I can't. I'll be so tired if I even try to get to the end of that book by today. Oh, go on. No, but 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 go on. I'm not going to argue, Badger. We wait until tomorrow before carry on reading Frankenstein. Why can't you just give me sneak peeks of the ending? Spoilers, Badger. Spoilers. Now, come on, Solomon. I like spoilers. Please tell me what happened at the end. No. Well, that means I'll have to read it myself. What, no! Badger, you're not supposed to look at the book. Badger, give me that. Give me that. Will you give me... That! Oh, 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 oh. Oh, no. That was the most stupid and terrible thing to happen. Better check if he's okay. Sawman, wake up. Please. What? Badger, you can't read the book. What? But look! Ah! <sighs> well, at least he's okay, but I'll just have to leave him until tomorrow. Oh, no. Oh, no. I'll go and get some socks to put over my ears, and that way I won't be able to hear the noise of thunder. <sighs> oh. Oh. Ah. There. That's better. Finally, I can get some sleep. And you got those replicated badger body parts yet, Igor? Yes, Simon. It's all here. Right. Now, this experiment is a tricky one, but it's still a good one we must try. If it doesn't work, then that's just that. Are you sure you know what you're doing with this experiment? Of course I know what I'm doing, Igor. I do, I do, I do. Alright, son, you don't need to get dramatic. Don't need to get dramatic. If we want to do this experiment, let's get on with it. But what if the so-called creation goes wrong and does terrible effects like, I don't know, mad... Well, I just hope it doesn't too, Igor. Now, let's just get on with the experiment and let's not hear any more about it. Please yourself. <laughs> Excellent. Now, it's time to stitch this glorious catastrophe together! <laughs> <laughs> right, you ready, Igor? Ready. Then let the creature come alive! <laughs> it's alive! It's alive! I've done it! <laughs> No, 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 Badger Stein, come back, I've got to follow him, Badger Stein, stop, stop, why should I stop, mortal, I can have my revenge, and wipe out this planet and replace the human race with a species like me. If you move forward to try and stop me, I'll destroy you with radioactive mashed potato. Radioactive mashed potato? But, Badgerstein, please, don't destroy the world! I can do what I like, mortal, and there's no point stopping me. No! No! Please don't kill me! Please don't kill me! No! No! Pretty 
yet. Now, I can have all the power in the world! <laughs> Badger, I want to work with you about... Badger, you seem distressed. Is there anything the matter with you? Badger? Badger? Talk to me! Badger? Oh no. I think I'll have to make him smell mashed potato. No! Oh, no. oh, 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 oh my foot! Oh more head. Oh you alright? Like? Well apart from me club on the bots with a book. Where's the radioactive mashed potato? Radioactive mashed potato? No, wait a minute. I'm not bad, just uh, Of course. It was a dream. What did you say about radioactive mashed potato? Oh, never mind, Solomon. Let's just say I owe you an apology for what happened yesterday. That's all right, Badger. You've been sleeping for a few hours after breakfast. Breakfast? I better go and have it. But, Badge, it's nearly lunchtime. Duh. <laughs>